Alright guys, how's it going? I needed to make a couple of welds on an asset and I'm pretty lazy so I stumbled across the welder add-on. I think this has actually been covered recently by another YouTube, I'll stick the link down below, uh, go and subscribe to the guy. But I'll also put the link to the add-on down below. So thank you to the developer. So to use the welder plugin it's pretty simple, install the plugin just like normal. Now bring up the properties tab and you can see here we have welder. So using the plugin is dead easy. So select the objects that we want to weld together. So it'll be this piece and this piece. Now if you come up here we get different weld types which is pretty good. And simply hit weld. Now if I scroll left and right you can see the size becoming bigger and smaller. So let's find somewhere in between, so something like that. If I left click it will change the direction of the array. So once you're happy, left click again, left click again and that will commit. Now we get this awesome weld, pretty damn cool. Now you can take a quick look at the modifier stack and you can actually see it's just an array so we, you can change the array count. So if you're not happy you could probably overlap it again. Now this can be animated so if you're doing like spot welding you could add a particle emitter like sparks and you can have this cool animation but I just need the model. So we'll just take a look at one or two more options. So we'll try a different weld type, we'll kind of do a this is my kind of welding. Let's go to weld, same again, up and down to control the size so this will need to be quite small. Yeah something like that. Left click, I can change the rotation so if it's not perfect, yep yeah, something like that. Left click again to commit. So you can already start to see how quick it is to make welds. Now this is perfect, especially if it's away in the background or something and you just need some topology to catch the light. Now you do have another option and that's to draw. So if you click draw, let's do something like this. So draw something, right click and it'll actually create a weld for you, which is pretty cool. That's more like my welding. Now you could maybe take this up a level. If you look at the Python file, you'll see that there's a Python file and a Blender file. And that pretty much has the welds which Python links to. So you could start building different types of welds, so you're not necessarily restricted to just these five options. So keep that in mind, and play around with the script. So you can pretty much see this is a great plugin. I would never be able to do anything like this. Do me a favour guys, like the video and subscribe to the channel. You know what to do. Peace.